Hello guys, this is Warrior here, and we are back with another Viva La France episode, where we have... Last episode, we took Brandenburg, we freed Saxony from the clutches of the Prussians, we seized Silesia, and peaced out with the Prussians at large. We are at the end turn, we're repairing everything, we looted Brandenburg, and we used that money to then go back into key locations, building whatnot. And I did a few extra buildings during the intern phase. We need to start building up all this. I'll probably get rid of this and swap that over to probably a theater and just try and get money, make this a money producer and switch over my war effort other than Paris and Champagne. But we'll see about that. So let's intern and see what happens. We are at war with the Ottomans. So I'm recruiting troops in Austria to push against the Ottomans. For some reason, they declared war on me. I have no idea why. But they decided, hey, let's declare war on the French. So we'll uh, teach them the error of their ways. We need to start building up our trade fleet as well. Mecklenburg and, De and the Danes are at war with me. So I have a feeling we're going to have to deal with them at some point. Yep, and they just moved in. Great. Wittenberg and the Prussians are still at war. I'm gonna have to go relieve the siege of Brandenburg or risk losing that highly veteran army. Operation Warsaw. I see that. It's a very veteran army. Did I even best that? <whistles> even fighting it's going to be close because this army is shattered. The only real... Mm. Yeah. Mecklenburg has caught me flat-footed. I did not anticipate them attacking the way they did. Hello guys, this is Warrior here, and we are back with a, another Napoleon Let's Play episode where we're playing the European campaign. So, we sacked Warsaw and used the money to upgrade certain buildings and whatnot. We do have certain um, something brewing that is of a bit of a concern, and... Because we're at war with these guys right here. And they have enough of a force that if they attacked me right now, I would lose the battle, I have a feeling. Because this, this army is mauled. So let's move you to there. And just, just hold out there. You... We'll put one, one unit there in case they try and move you up to the river yeah yeah let's let's do that let's do that and move you up to there so if they do go after it we'll get the replenishment because the way replenishment works uh, but if you're in a siege if they besiege you then it's it's not how it works all right um we're replenishing, we're replenishing, we're recruiting a lot of troops. We can actually get some more troops if I wanted to. Let's get some more. Alright. Is there any more troops I can get right here? No. There is not. I could recruit some more troops somewhere else, though. Prague. 
you could Bohemia. Uh, we need to upgrade the that to a great arsenal. Yeah, it's ordnance factory. We need that because if we get the oh wait, we have oh yeah, we have more places to recruit. Okay, so Orleans, you go for that. You're going after improved copper plating. That's great, I guess. Um, you go there. <coughs> Grand battery. That gives us an ordnance board, which gives us the six inch howitzers, the altar, artillery de pill. And that's it. Oh, National Guard you can get from here. Okay, okay. Makes sense. Let's in turn and see what happens. That Prussian battle, we were heavily mauled. Napoleon's force was heavily, heavily mauled by the Prussians, and they resisted bitterly to the end. <clears throat> so we're going to go two episodes of Napoleon and Eastern Roman, and only one. Ooh, the sweets. I've decided to attack. Okay. They went that way. Alright, that's actually better <clears throat> than the alternative. Uh, at Wittenberg, what are you doing? Not too bad. That was actually really stupid of you, Sweden. Really, really, really stupid. Liberation. Nice. Close. Awesome. Alright, um. That's actually prime. Allows us to build the cannonade frigates. Alright. Oh, what is that doing? Yes, over here. Need to get that dry dock going so we can get the bigger ships. But <clears throat> we need. Um, are we recruiting? Yeah, we are. Okay, I was like, I thought we were. Alright. Just keep them queued up. You come down here. You're about to join in there, which will give us even more money coming in. Yep, up to 1500 now. So that's good. It's about 500 to ship. You're trading. You're sitting over here defending. Right, just hold out there. Now you're coming around. About to have another wave of reinforcements to the battlefield. Yep, about to have some more, more, some more, more troops, some more troops. That's terrible English. But that was a terrible idea, Sweden. How? I don't understand this, but all right. Alright, how are we doing? So they have three line infantry and a bunch of cavalry. Alright. Alright, I know we're under strength, but still. Put you. Good. The rest of you will form a line and basically just smash him. I had the huzzahs. That was a good hit. Monsieur. 
Home square. Move against them. Get him. Take the charge. Get him back. Casualties, but it's not going to end well. Concentrate fire in the infantry. In. A glorious victory, sir, is soon to be yours. He's not pulling up a flag for the general. That's interesting. That looks like he died. Settle this in a gunfight. Yeah, it's just them. And they're running. Oh, they actually come back. That's interesting. Get them, and that should lead to a very quick death. <laughs> That army is a lot more put together. We need to heal. Let's move you to the river. Heal up there. You're healing just fine. Brandenburg, we don't have the money. Uh, well, actually, we do have the money. We just don't have the... One more turn, we'll have more troops. Let's pop that in. Me another unit. Chasseurs Savelle, move to there. Boom, we're good. There we are. Croatia, you do not, but I think they're moving there. So we're about to have some troops out. We'll start shuttling some troops around. Venice, yep, those four are going to go there. You're going to start building up. Because I have a feeling they're about to get froggy. Alright. Actually, instead of going north, come over here. Alright. Let's in turn again and see what happens. Good. Looks like they're trying to push troops over to their other settlement. Yeah, the Prussians beat them. So I don't mean nothing.
That's good. Idiotic, but good. So many. Doing results. Steady hand. Was killed. Awesome. So you can only have four in one location. Got it. Keep going. Move you to Croatia. Yep, keep all right, get me some troops. You three move up here. Silesia, you are doing wonderful. We have a full fringe army with veteran artillery and plenty of infantry. You should be fine. And if we need to move east, we can. Change you over to a factory. You gather up there. Oh, this army's ready to fight. Yeah, we're ready to brawl now. Mecklenburg. Nous avons triomphé. Really, you withdrew to mordre la poussière. Hurra! Hurra! En avant! Pour la couronne et le pays! Tenez-vous prêt! Move to the stables. Marchez! Monsieur? Move to the town. Yeah, they, they don't like us. <clears throat> That'll be fine. We'll get another turn of replenishment. He won't make a move. We'll crush Mecklenburg. Push over to the Danes. Maybe peace out with them. Or push north and secure all of this in creative Norway. Come back down. I'd give us all of that. And then it would just be this little enclave over here. And then finishing off the Austrians and the Prussians and the Russians. And then whatever we decide to do in Italy. <clears throat> and then Great Britain. Great Britain hasn't really done much. It's kind of just sitting there. Bama Republic, I think, is keeping them occupied at the moment. Yeah. Keep gathering up troops. We're about to have enough to push onto Cleves Mark. Keep building troops. We're getting artillery and stuff like that. Alright. Oh, hello. Italy, you have two armies that you're not doing anything with them. Could have you fight the Pope. That would be hilarious. Declare war on the Pope. Rebellion! You have an army here and an army there. Just two, though. It would be funny if I gave that to Saxony. <laughs> That'd be hilarious. Alright. You three are moving up. From the south. Let's move you there. Good. You're basically healed up. You're enough to... Crush the Jaegers. Monsieur, posons le camp. Right. En avant, marchez. 
You, on the other hand, are dangerously exposed at the moment. If they move against us, we might, in a defensive posture, be able to withstand them in Brandenburg, but not anywhere else. Russia! Hey, we're at war with you. Russia, would you take peace? No. Ottomans, would you take peace? Great Britain, would you take peace? Alright, Austria, let's see here. Are you swapping? Regard the theft, whatever. Let's see. But you. Spain, I can talk to you some stuff I need. Welcome, Danes. Would you take peace? Huh. They have a mighty power and they're rich. Okay, I'm not entirely sure how that works. I don't consider you mighty, but okay, whatever. I guess it's in the eye of the beholder, I guess. I'm not entirely sure. You stay there. We don't have cannons, but we do have artillery. Monsieur. Move you four up there. Let's see if they want a brawl. Start building that. You're almost built, and you're almost built, and you are built. Let's move you there. You need to open that up. And you just plop yourself right there. There we go. That's the instant money I want to see. And you just kind of protect the eastern areas. Change you over to a tax office. That will make more sense there. Alright, back on the home front. You move there. Gather up with him. Now that's enough to be a problem. You go there. You? <coughs> Fine. Move up here. Get to this area. That's a full on core now. We can get whatever else we need later. Alright. That is my only problem. I don't think they'll immediately attack. I think they'll wait a turn. So let's see what happens. See what the Russians do if the Russians advance. We will get cavalry during the end turn. They do not attack me. Good. I must have stayed where they were. Could give the Italians Venice and Croatia. That would be something. Alright, they are actually going to move against me. So all of these Jaegers and cavalry and 12-pound guns. It's a very interesting force to get there. In a city. Oh yeah, we're definitely going to make use of the city. An open field battle? You could give me a run for my money. 
but not in a city battle. Alright, so we know of some of their... Alright. So, we'll be protected by... Limited artillery. So put you there. Artillery is my main concern. Or cavalry charges is my main concern. So we're going to protect the flanks. You in the middle. And covering that approach. This spot right here, I want to be fortified. Stay behind the artillery. You will be moved as needed. There. Move you out. Cannon, don't just shoot. To shoot. We building. have taken the building, sir. I know. Thank you. That is a lot of cannons. All their Jaegers are coming in. I'm rushing a bunch of Jaegers on this right flank. If that's the case, rush out to me and side you over. Get over here. Taken the building, sir. Run. Yep. to them. Can't push any further with those guys who get us. Pull away. Rotate. Line infantry. 
engage those Jaegers in hand-to-hand -hand combat. If they don't want to force the issue, I, I'll let them. And we'll slowly pull back in. But we shattered four of those Jaegers. <coughs> and they put stakes right there. Shoot at him. Shots out of us as we run away. As soon as they get free of. As soon as we get free of all that, then we can move. You two. Occupy that building. You come out of the building. What's up, Dragoons? That was smart. Compagnie en ligne, préparez-vous. Ligne prête, monsieur. You. Come over here. And you two form up. There's four Jaegers. There's a lot of artillery and a lot of cavalry still there. Pull back inside. Pull back inside. One Jaeger group. See if we can lure them in. Take that building. We have taken the building, sir. What, monsieur? Be partially protected by some of the cannons. These cannons can shoot. from behind. They were getting crushed. Whoops. Move you right there. Our men are running, sir.
Oh, that's not good. Get him. Good volleys, come on. Running, sir. Oh, that unit, that's fine. Well, they were able to save the Jaegers. Shift back over, light infantry. idiotic and placed it the wrong way. Get him. There we go. Good musket volley into him. Recharge them. Close range, that's not going to be good. Yep. There, that's the general. They still have their cannons. Well, that's one way to ensure that they'll die. Kind of trapped. <laughs> you got, you got this this way, this this way. So you're kind of trapped. Right. Circle around. You need to avoid those stakes. They just have that one dragoon. Is all they got left. And then they got this artillery. Light infantry move up. Move down. Oh, not you. You stay there. You. That way. Move in after them. Defeat that Yegas. This pull back. You pull back. Good. Pull back behind the stakes. They've been crushed. And we're just going to ride the remainder of this time out. Assaulting that artillery with the dragoons, I, I, it would produce too many casualties. So we'll just wait and i will see y'all in a minute so if you i i cut out <laughs> me just sitting here but that was the right thing to do i was going to take way too many casualties the other way so let's play what we can get ourselves into fantastic Nice. Nice. There. Yeah, we need to start building up some economic ventures. Definitely. Alright, moving you on. Move through and come up right there. 
Napoleon, <laughs> smash them, please. Go north towards the whole staples and hold there. Alright, so. Move you up. You are proving to be remarkably annoying. You're waiting. Hero of the army. Oh, that's good. Where is the... there they are. Move them down here. It'll take three turns, but you'll start giving back way more than your upkeep cost. And everywhere else... Silesia, you have an army that's ready to go. Let's move you west. Yeah, I think... Okay, so one occupation is going down, so you're okay. Move you up here, and we'll push in and deal with the Danes and all of that. And this army will move up as well. Now, over here, there isn't much else I can do. I'm going to keep this strong, because I don't like what the Russians are doing. But we'll go from there. Ah, Wittenberg is whooping up on that Prussian butt. Good. Need other allies who are competent and are doing more than what the Spanish are doing. You are on strike again. I have one more rebellion, at least. And there's our artillery. Did you go away? I think so. How's the monetary crisis? Ooh, we're going to be in negative 78 dollars. So move you there. Move you there. Let's look at this. Some attacks. Okay. We're going to have to start taxing you. That should solve our income problem. Yes, that is solving our income problem. We're going to be up by 1600. Good. Alright. You go there. Let's move. Uh, I'll give you the other unit of Charles Chavel. Let's move across. Mecklenburg, you've made a very fatal error. Making an enemy out of Napoleon. I don't think I don't think. Yeah. You go there. You go back over here to Brandenburg. Go ahead. There we go. Now, you are friendly towards me. Might, given the chance, Wittenberg, I'm going to allow them to take all of this, but we are going to use you as a puppet. So now you're going to move south, and you're going to move south and take over Hanover, and possibly get an alliance with Oldberg, Oldenberg, give them that, and then that'll give some sort of parity in the north, and then we're going to go after the Danes. You... Keep moving. You're coming over here. The Ottomans are getting up. Okay, they still do not like that, so we're going to need a large garrison there. Oh, hello. That's where you went. Okay. Oh, 
why I still have several militia units in this army, but I do have a lot of cavalry. You're going to respond, and you have a lot of Cossacks. A lot of Cossack cavalry. I think we'll end it, and this is where we'll start the, the new episode. So, until next time, hope you have a good rest of your day, and I'll see you in the next one. Ciao for now.